Hey guys, in this short video I will show you how to set up your new iPhone and that means transferring the data from your old iPhone to your new iPhone so it is pretty much the exact copy of your old iPhone data to your new iPhone and that data may include your apps, your contacts, your messages, uh, your photos and pretty much everything else that you have done from your old iPhone and you're transferring it to your brand new phone. Uh, now, you don't need a computer or even an iCloud. You can use this method from an iPhone 7 to an iPhone 13 to the latest uh, and current iPhone series. Now, if you find this tutorial to be helpful, make sure to uh, like this video and subscribe to my channel. That way you will be able to see the latest uh, and watch the latest iPhone hack and tech reviews. So, you know, let's get to it. Now, the first thing that you want to do is get your old iPhone, I repeat, old iPhone, not the new one, uh, and go ahead and press settings. Look for the general tab and then scroll all the way down where it's transfer or reset iPhone. Press that. He'll give you a prompt. Don't reset it. Don't erase it. Um, you know, go ahead and read the top part of the content and press get started. Now, go ahead and get your new iPhone, the, you know, the phone that you want to transfer the data to. Go ahead and set it aside next to your old iPhone, much like, you know, as it is on the video. Turn it on. You'll see the you know, Apple logo with the language prompt and, you know, etc. Leave that alone. Don't press the, you know, language uh, prompt. Now on your old iPhone to the left, turn the screen on and once it detects there is a new iPhone nearby that wants to set up your data, it'll set you up with this uh, QR code looking deal. Uh, and what you want to do is hover the old iPhone uh, to this blob on your new iPhone and you know it gives you a prompt for the passcode for your old iPhone. Enter the old password and once it does that, it'll set up your iPhone. It gives you these prompts that it will take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Uh, go ahead and wait for that for a moment. Now, it'll take probably about 5 minutes all the way up to 25 minutes, depending on how much data that you have. Now, the next prompt will uh, allow you to set up a Face ID. Uh, but I guess for this purpose, uh, for setting up the new data, we'll go ahead and set it up later. And then it'll give you this prompt to transfer your data. What we're doing is transferring it from an iPhone, not from a cloud, but we're pretty much transferring it directly from your old iPhone to your new iPhone. So hit the bottom one where it says transfer. Uh, and then it gives you the prompt to set up your Apple ID gives you all this long list, blah, blah, terms and conditions. Go ahead and press and agree. It'll set up your Apple ID. And then the next prompt will ask you to enter your Apple ID. This is not your password for your phone. This is the password when you sign up for the cloud uh, for your Apple ID. It includes your email address on apple.com. And it says make this your new iPhone prompt. Go ahead and press continue. And then keep your iPhone up to date. Continue. And the next prompt will ask you to set up your Apple Pay. Skip that and you can do that you know later or anytime you have your phone. And now you you know it gives you uh, you know a status of transferring your phone now this video is kind of sped up a little bit so that way you don't have to look at the blank screen uh, so feel free to pause this video as you wish based according to the amount of data that you have on your phone it may take a little longer and then once a transfer is complete it'll give you a prompt on your old iPhone uh, on the left, go ahead and press continue and then the message will say erase this phone. Uh, don't erase it for now. It pretty much gives you a backup just in case something goes wrong during the transfer. 
and you want to compare it to you know your old iPhone and your new iPhone. And then on the right side is your brand new iPhone and it'll give you progress of the transfer uh, status with an Apple logo. And then it'll give you the uh, you know the welcome screen. Now go ahead and swipe up. Well, hang on a second here. The uh, the screen kind of turned off because of the screen timeout. Now go ahead and turn it back on and go ahead and swipe up. Type in your password. It'll give you a prompt for the SIM card. That's okay. You can install it later. And as you can see, the apps will slowly appear uh, and initialize uh, on your brand new iPhone. Now be patient on this one. Like I said, it's going to take between 5 minutes all the way up to 30 minutes depending on how much data that you have, how much photos that you have. And uh, once that is completed, now if you haven't set up your SIM card, go ahead and get your SIM card pin removal tool. Go ahead and poke it where there is a tray. Make sure not to poke your microphone. Now insert the SIM card into the tray. Now guys, if you like this video, go ahead and like and subscribe. That way you'll be able to be notified when a new video comes out. Thanks guys and see you next time.